Ori Catapult is working in the offshore renewable energy sector. Our organisation is a research and innovation based organisation. At this site in Blythe, we focus on testing and validation of offshore renewable technology. My work looks at kind of addressing climate change and so one of the ways we might do that is by decarbonising our energy systems. So over the next couple of decades we'll want to install more offshore wind farms in our seas and to do that we need to design the electrical infrastructure that connects those offshore wind turbines back to the onshore grid. We need a way to look at handling uncertainty when we're trying to make these decisions. And so my work has developed a tool to help decision makers plan and design these systems when they have these severe uncertainties. We will use statistical methods to kind of handle these uncertainties and that's kind of where the maths comes in. In a sense, what you're trying to do is you're trying to de-risk a planning decision and, and live with that level of uncertainty. By doing that, you can raise your confidence levels and potentially um, choose a solution that you may have not done so otherwise because you thought it was too risky. On this project there are a number of people that are working on that so we have mainly two academics from the university together with myself we're working in collaboration with uh, a number of people in the offshore renewable energy catapult and they have supported the project and helped steer its direction. The benefit of collaborating with universities like Durham is that there are skills and expertise within that university that, that we don't have ourselves at, at ORE Catapult. We can take some good ideas and, and solutions that have developed in the university and, and, and push those out to, to industry applications. So without the APSERC funding, I'd say that this project wouldn't have gone ahead. Um, it has given us the, uh, the funds to allow the collaboration to continue. It's um, given us time to develop the work further. It's given us time to explore commercial routes um, for our work that we have developed. Our business model is we, we get a, a core grant from government, but we need to top that up. So EPSERC funding, which, which we're using as a co-fund in this case, is, is absolutely critical to doing these projects. I would recommend that other researchers seek out the EPSERC funding to see what opportunities it could allow them to, to continue.